Hey guys, Chris Cervantes, you guys in the courts. Now, let's cut the bullshit intro for a second, bro. Okay. I show you my life. If you're new here, that's what I do. And I show you how I'm evolving. However, I like to expose the truth, bro. I put it in my playlists for the ones I think are more important than the others. But this one, bro, is going to affect you and it's going to affect me. Observe, bro. This might be my most important video yet. I'm not even joking. Watch. As more people get vaccinated, a doctor has created a, you know, way to show off your COVID vaccination status. What do they call it? Immunoband. It's basically a bracelet. It's, I mean, it's rubber, got a little bit of metal on it, that allows you to digitally access your COVID-19 vaccination documentation, if that makes sense. It was designed to help businesses reopen. Specifically, a lot of restaurants are using it, you know, like the wait staff. You know, if they ask, hey, have you been vaccinated? So, starting today, employees at a local restaurant will be sporting them for the first time ever. Um, hi, Dr. Merton. Good to have you here, president of the Uniband. Uh, welcome to Philly. Welcome to Good Day Philadelphia. Thank you. Good morning to you. So what is the idea? The idea is that as we come back together as a society, it's nice to have a way to tell each other, I'm safe and I've been vaccinated. And then for businesses particularly, it's a way to help them open up and help the company public to be more comfortable as they see that, for example, the wait staff have got the immune band and you know, they've been vaccinated and they're safe, particularly given that the CDC has now said that vaccinated people don't need to wear masks outdoors. Uh, and in addition, it's a good way to have your vaccination documentation with you. We had two people with immunobands use them to get into the Madison Square Garden to see the Knicks la uh, last night where they required vaccination uh, because you just access the QR code and there's your there's your and the QR code, code is on the top of the bracelet. That's correct. Okay. And that's um, really beneficial because right now people have been holding a little piece of paper and they've been trying to keep up with it and bring wherever. Okay, bro. I made it short because all the rest was really slight. No nonsense, bro. So. Do you see that shit? They're giving you your own tech. To prove you fucking have the shot, bro. Now, I don't know about you. But I think that's like the mark of the beast. I swear to God this is. When have you seen this, bro? When have you seen it? Soon? Everything, bro. It's going to be like that soon. Where you don't have that shot, you're not going anywhere. You ain't going to no store. You're not going to no event. You can't get gas, fix your car, anything, bro. They're trying to make it so you don't ascend, bro. Now, I've got my issues, bro. But I know, bro. It's... There ain't no fucking way I'm going to do that shit, bro. Hell no. You got to look at really inside yourself. Because if you haven't repaired, bro, now would be the fucking time, bro. And honestly, in some areas, bro, I hate, I'm not trying to be a Debbie Downer, bro. Because everything is impossible. And nothing's impossible, bro. But, bro, you should have been knowing this shit by last year. <laughs> at least. If it, this was this time last year, I'd say have a way. But it's not, bro. And even there's some things I haven't done yet. But I promise you, I will, bro. Starting tomorrow. You know? Think about it, bro. What's this world going to be like in about another year? Are you willing to give up everything you love just so you can reach a higher power of consciousness 
and like having a love fulfilling life? I can't answer that question, bro. For you. Only you can, bro.